Hello, is this the research lab? My name is Diaf and McKinney failed. My GFR is less than 5. I have been dependent on the D machine for all my life. Yes, I do 3 sessions a week at the center in town and I don't want to do that anymore. I don't want to be tied to a machine. I want to participate in your trial. Diaf decided that day that she wouldn't be dependent of the big D machine anymore. DF is a 22-year-old woman born with a genetic condition presenting to the center of her last session with the D machine of her life. Catherine here, welcome today to a message of hope. A miracle happened in the life of someone who really needed it and we are going to witness it. DF a woman born with a genetic condition went from needing three sessions a week with a D-machine to complete freedom in just one week. And this is no work of fiction. What we are going to witness today is based on a case report that was published in a prestigious peer-reviewed journal and which is supported by scientific evidence. And I've been working with people suffering from this kind of problems for more than 10 years now. And I've met countless people who were all told the same thing by professionals. There is nothing we can do. We just wait for ESRF and then you start the big D. And you know what one of the worst parts is? Somehow, it's always all your fault. Professionals always seem to find a reason why you have this problem, which is entirely up to you. Something you did, something you eat, it's always your fault. Now imagine telling that to someone who is 22, or even worse, to someone who is not even old enough to understand what you are saying. It's not common to see a 22-year-old ending up with ESRF. Let's see how this happened to her. It was clear since the beginning that poor DF never had a chance. There was nothing she could have done to prevent ending up needing RRT. In the case of DF, it wasn't her fault, and no one could have told her that. DF reached the final stage way too soon. She was born with a genetic condition that caused her nephrons to stop working completely. Nephrons are the filtering units of the kidney. During her entire life, she was constantly suffering from uremic signs caused by renal issues even without knowing it. The researchers following her case believe that even her growth was hindered by her problem. And they eventually found out what was causing her to reach ESRF so soon. DF was suffering from a genetic form called chronic glomerulonephritis. This is a form of RF caused by one or more genes not working correctly. Some people are born with it and there is nothing they can do except RRT or the big D. But this was not the case for DF because she was part of a trial that found a working alternative to RRT. But despite having a GFR lower than 5 since the day she was born, this woman was eventually able to avoid RRT or the big D. You see, she was just enrolled in a trial that would change her life forever. A very promising trial, a trial that bought us one of the most useful supplements you can find today. A natural nutrient that was going to completely stop her need for the big D. This natural supplement you see here has incredible properties. It's a natural free radical scavenger, meaning that it protects the body from the number one cause of aging. Most importantly, when assumed orally in large doses, it actually acts as a natural form of... This is a salbu fiber that acts like a brush in the intestine. And when DF started to take this, what happened to her is simply incredible. And as I was saying, these findings changed the field of nephrology completely. Yes, what you see here is called acacia fiber. Now, what you should know about this supplement is that it is perfectly safe. It's not an allergen, it's not modified, and it's completely natural. 
it's very often used in packaged foods to preserve their freshness so probably you already had some of it without knowing but clearly there is a difference in the way someone will take a quiche fiber as a supplement compared to what you will get in packaged foods now a very important question is this really proven to work and how can you benefit from these findings as i was saying the fks really changed things in the scientific community many studies were done on people with renal issues after this incredible result more recently this supplement was also tested in other people with issues similar to that of the f 36 people currently undergoing rrt were trialed with it for three months and they all had significant improvements in creatinine levels urea and other parameters now even more incredible in 2019 the same researcher that helped the f decided to help even more people because he really believes in this supplement as a way to replace rrt so he did another trial larger this time he tested this supplement in nine people all of them were undergoing rrt before starting a cage fiber af in short now the incredible part all of them were able to stop rrt to avoid the need for the big d machine thanks to af some of them for two years and one even for eight years now guys this story is quite amazing and gives us new hope for all those in need for RRT and seeing the impressive results these researchers were able to achieve with DF there's one question that absolutely needs an answer can you still benefit from a cash fiber if you are in stage 3 or 4? yes absolutely it's clear as per scientific evidence that a cash fiber can help lower creatine levels in all the stages this is a powerful anti-inflammatory and antioxidant that scans free radicals in the body. Now, while the main advantage of AF is another, don't underestimate this benefit. You see, many researchers believe that antioxidants are the new frontier when it comes to improving the filtering ability of the renal system, when it comes to lowering creatinine levels. And by the way, I really believe that really all of us can seriously benefit from antioxidants. Science says that they can greatly delay the need for RRT in people with CP. I'll talk more in depth about how to achieve this in my video up here and also down in the description, by the way. But it's clear that someone who's taking acacia fiber to, you know, avoid the need for RRT needs way more than antioxidants, no matter how powerful they are. And in fact, the main advantage of this powerful natural element is another. You see, this fiber is able to bind when entering the intestine through uremic tactins. Now, if someone is in need to avoid RRT, the only way to achieve that today is relying on a substance that can get rid of what causes all the problems related to ESRF. And a way to tell if these cores are present in someone's body is creatinine. And well, speaking of which, be prepared to be shocked. You know, DF was able to completely stop RRT just one week after starting to take AF and researchers had to monitor her creatinine levels to make sure she wasn't risking anything. Incredibly, after just 21 days, her creatinine dropped from 15.32 mg per dl to 3.39 mg per dl, which is what someone in stage 3 would have. But after some time, her creatinine went even lower at just 2.3 mg per dl, which is frankly astonishing. Now, we will see if DF story eventually had a happy ending in a moment. Before that, let's take a look at how this supplement can actually help you from a practical point of view. As usual, remember to consult with a professional before changing anything in your regimen. Today, many people are already using AF. We have tons of data about it and we know that taking it the right way is key to get the results wanted. 
AF was tested in many studies in quantities ranging from 10 to 30 grams per day depending on various factors. For example, someone who wants to take care of their sugar levels would benefit from around 20 grams a day of AF. Around 15 grams taken before meals were used to control cholesterol levels. AF is usually in powder and mixed with a large glass of water several times per day. Using enough water is an important step because it's dietary fiber we are talking about here. And adding 15 to 20 grams of soluble dietary fiber to the diet is a sure way to get great benefit for the gut. Now, it also comes with a couple of potential unwanted facts. First, never take it without enough water. Also, soluble fiber might slow down the absorption of other substances, so don't take it at the same time as things that may be important. Cage fiber is very safe, however, and a lot of people use it every day. The supplement is also cheap and easy to find and can make all the difference in the world for those who want to avoid RRT as long as possible. So let's see how it ended for the app, shall we? Does the F story have a happy ending? When the F case was published, it was some kind of a record in the world of nephrology. It never happened before that a person as young as DF and with a GFR as low as what she had was able to avoid RRT for as long as she was able to. Four years! DF was able to achieve four years of beautiful, immensely significant freedom. Unfortunately, the case study doesn't go any farther, but we know that her well-being immensely improved during these four years because when her problem was under control with AF, the researchers that were following her were able also help her with other problems she had. This is why I'm inclined to believe that the reason why they stopped the trial so successful after four years was the transplant. I want to believe that she finally was in good shape enough to receive this immense gift and joy in life with a renowned sense of freedom. Okay guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you want to see more stories from scientific literature, this video up here may interest you. And this is all for today. Thank you for watching. God bless.